Love the cities here on the Sander Van Buren tour bus all across Canada. We're here at the government and we're going to have a word so with Sander really himself. Fall. Love the cities here with Sander Van Dorn. We are on his tour bus across Canada here at the government. We are so excited to be here and we love that you're doing a bus tour. Yeah. What's up with that? It's the first time for me. Uh, it's uh, absolutely insane. It's, uh, you know, from the very first show we did in uh, Kingston up until now, it's been um, a big adventure, I can tell you. I can imagine. You know, we're crammed into uh, this bus with like uh, about 12 people, I think, at this stage. Wow. And, uh, you know, during the day, this is actually our studio. And during the night, this is the whole bus becomes an after party club. <laughs> it's, uh, it's pretty, pretty intense, you know. It's, uh, it's not much sleep at all. It's, uh, go, go, go. Yeah, go, go, go. But, uh, you know, like I said, you know, every single gig um, from the first one until now has been absolutely insane. So I'm really happy with this too. That's exciting. Yeah. How come you chose, are you doing this all over the world or did you choose Canada specifically to do this bus tour? I, I, I really wanted to do Canada. Uh, I don't know why, you know, it's, it's just like I have a really good click, you know, with people okay. over here, for instance, government. I'm so happy I'm actually playing one of the, the last shows over here because I heard it's, it's coming close. Um, so, uh, you know, I just felt like let's let's start doing the first bus tour over here in Canada. And I'm actually thinking about uh, doing the next bus tour about 40 shows. So it's, it's going to be, uh, this is going to be like the showcase to see how it works. But, you know, it's, it's such a big success already. Exactly that you guys are promoting on this on this bus tour. Uh, that you have a couple other guys with you yeah, talking yeah. about them and the tour yeah. and what it is that you're actually trying to. Yeah, get yeah. Out there. I'm, I'm here with uh, the guys from Firebeats uh, and uh, Julian Jordan, and um, you know, uh, definitely we're going to promote all the artists uh, and a little bit of promotion of the label as well. You know, it's right. a Dawn Records uh, bus tour, uh, but in general, it's just like uh, having a great time, doing doing great shows and uh, producing tracks. Uh, we're actually producing a track right now on the bus, so it's. Uh, it's a big creative environment uh, during the day. You know, like I said, during the night, it's like a uh, cr crazy party. <laughs> it's interesting because back in the 1970s, that's what artists did, that's what bands did. They traveled around on buses. So that must actually enhance your creativity, actually being on like a bus, creating music. I, I mean, I don't know if you, if you saw the driver. He's actually uh, an old uh, ACDC driver. He's like an oh, old wow. rock star, and uh, he, this is his life. This is his, his house. So he does, he yeah. tours yeah. artists. Yeah, he tours artists. So, uh, <laughs> You know, it's a different ball game. Um, you know, bands they, they travel together. They, well, they produce an album, travel together for a few months, uh, make a big fight, <laughs> then they need a few months to uh, you know to recover, and then they go back into the studio. You know, the life of a DJ is like constantly being on a plane every single weekend, uh, producing music on the road in the studio at home. It's, it's like it's a 24/7 endeavor, and uh, you know, this is kind of like more of going back to the whole rock star roots. I, I, I really like that. Amazing. Yeah. So, um, why don't you tell me a little bit about how you manage everything you have. You have identity, you have door records, and you have your tour and everything yeah. else you're doing. How do you manage all that? Well, like I said, it's a 24-7 thing. <laughs> yeah. you know, it's, it's, I produce my radio show during the week. Um, you know, I manage my label, I go to a lot of demos, do a lot of A&R. I, I love doing that, you know, it, it, it creates such such a big, um, um, how to say, um, uh, like, like a different kind of uh, vibe throughout my whole career. Um, all of a sudden, you're, you're, you're managing artists, uh, you're doing the whole, guiding through the whole process. I actually learned a lot um, in, in this process as well. And uh, besides that, you know, you're also a producer, so you produce music. Uh, I do everything myself, so it's it's like an, it's, it's it's a pretty big big job in this day. Yeah. Something I do really want to ask you is how um, you got into producing and how your mentality is when you're producing from when you first started up until now, because I think you're very creative and you have a very Bjorn sound. So when it's you, you know it's you, and that's what I admire about you. Ah, so cool. what is it yeah. that that motivates you to come up with new creative tracks? I, you know, it's, for instance, uh, doing the collaboration with Oliver Helmans, it's actually going back to my old roots, and, and it's funny, you know, people say it's like, it's such a refreshing sound, but it's actually, for me, it's like bringing back some old, you know, uh, tricks, uh, you know, into my project. Um, you know, that's the way to do it, it's, uh, it's, you have this whole back catalog of music, 
Um, I've listened to dance music for the last 25 years at least, and you know, use that, you know, use those ideas, use that inspiration, and uh, you listen to the tra the sound that's out there, and to try to make it your own and to make it something different. And um, yeah, it's a chance every single time, but uh, I, ma I managed so far. Great. Yeah. Okay, my last question for you is what can we expect? What kind of secrets do you have in store for us? I got a few new tracks <laughs> I'm going to play out. Um, Are we going to hear them today? Yes. Amazing. Yes. Um, a lot of tracks and board records, uh, some new edits, some new remixes, so um, it's going to be great. Amazing. We're excited. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I love your tour, Sandra Venter, and you guys check them out online. Social media is at the bottom. Thank you so much. Play a great show tonight at Gov. Is this going to be your last show at Gov? I think it is. Yeah, yes. Gov is closing yeah. soon. This is the last time you can catch Sandra tonight. So we're going to check it out. Peace. <laughs>